Oh, recording, okay, from Mrs. Roddenberry to Yin Gazda, the back of a photo which I'll show. Okay, that is from Mrs. Roddenberry in Bel Air to Yen Gasta who visited there. <coughs> Excuse me, these photos were taken by Mel These photos were taken by Mel Ernest Winfield. Uh, my gun survived, luckily. Stupid me, trying to wreck a good thing. However, other things kind of melted away. She, talk about stupid I am. Wow, this is 1999 summer. To Mrs. Roddenberry, when Yin was visiting her in Bel Air. I have her house on video. Gotta upload the video. Oh, I already did a, this one, V'ger, that's on the back of the photograph. Now this photo, I have a bunch of these, by the way. They're from Mrs. Roddenberry to Ian Gazda, who gave them to me, okay? But the picture of the Klingon in the middle is kind of odd looking. So maybe it's a mistake or a wrong photo or a misfire or something, I don't know. I have a bunch of them given to me by Ian before she went to India from Mrs. Roddenberry. Oh, believe it or not, this is me sitting on the porch at Dr. Peter Kokoschnig's home in Hendorf and Wallersey. I think I got a, a cool hairstyle there. <laughs> I'm always into hair. A Eva Gabor style, hmm? And is wearing glosses. That was a long time ago. Holy macaroni. Oh, let's see. Crystal power wafer system, the large ones are made for Japan, the three volts, three ampere type, were tested by Kyoto Institute of Technology. Again, this is the Kyoto Institute of Technology. Okay, this is a diagram of the power unit I took to Japan for testing. A wafer, crystal wafer, sorry, I like the crystal wafers. I can make a general, a generator by, by the same circuit that you sent me. Parts, 18 kil, eight something rather. So that, yeah, they got a whole pile of them over there. Oh, this is a letter to me from Jack Hauk of McDonnell Douglas Aerospace Company. I met up with Jack Hauk again in um, Los Angeles in about 1989 with the Gasta and we had a good meal. Had a lot of fun. I think this is in the 90s, let's see. Oh, oh yeah, I think so. Oh, this is from Ken Shoulders to me. Ah, Dr. Elizabeth Rauscher is mentioned in here. <laughs> An interesting letter from Ken. I have a pile of them. Lots of stuff. This is from 8,000 papers I got. And a few I selected today to take photographs of. A photo of Norman Baker, who introduced kombucha tea. This is at his home in Pacific Palisades. Wow, a long time ago now. He's got a kombucha, kombucha mushroom right there, and he's making all kinds of cool stuff. So that's Norman Baker, good friend. I wonder if he's still alive. I don't know. I don't know how serious this one was. To be very short, I'm willing to front as much as 10 million US dollars for duplication results in your efforts. Oh, 
I wonder who in the hell this was. Subject offer October. Oh, what? October 12, 1999, I think. I have no idea. LW, actually. I have no idea who LW is. No, I don't. Maybe then I did. Okay, this is behind Dr. Peter Kokoschnik's home in Handorf and Wallace. That's me up in the jeans. Roland in the middle and brother off to the side. That's Captain Roland. Okay, this is uh, Ian Gasta and yours truly, me, having dinner at Dr. Peter Kokoschnik's home. And this is shortly after the auto accident. In the background is Bernard Brito's wife, I believe, with a child. Wow, this time. I think this was Canadian government test. I don't know. I forget what test it was. Some metals broke in half up there and others did not break in half. Wow, that's a long time ago. Ah, another test. Wavy form in metals. I don't, don't even know what these things are. I think one's a file broken up. The two on the left-hand side, side seem to be the same in a way of the action of the waves. A pair of vice grips that fell apart as well. Ha! Oh, well. This is inside, it, this is in San Francisco, Henry Dakin's home, where I stayed for a week as Prince Alfred von Liechtenstein was visiting for a week, and this is where I met Ken as well, a few times on and off. Henry Dakin, wow, that's kind of spooky looking at this. Uh, okay, this is Esquire magazine in Deutsch, in German. The article has featured the Brito brothers. I was mentioned in this article. I have no idea how Canadian or John. Okay, whatever. Okay. Interesting. I don't. Hmm. Gold. Vera Vandal in Conan Oda. Dabby, Roland's computer, career, Erstborg, Beach, Yeren. Oh, this is fascinating trying to read it. I just, I lived there for several years and a little over several years and I still can't understand Deutsch. Good God, Major. You read the good God. I don't know. Oh, okay, this is in uh, the apartment. Countermeasures gear, radar set off the actual set, working condition, a Canon, a uh, recorder, 42 channel input recorder, that was awesome piece. Yes, this is a Navy style computer monitor. Actually, very well built piece. And that's another shot of another recorder and some of the gear up in the, I still have in operation right now. Uh, this is off of HMCS Saskatchewan. It's a spook radio receiver, beautiful piece. I don't have it anymore, but oh well. This is the control panel area where I gave demos for dozens of television people and many others over the years. Still got a few pieces here. That thing did work pretty darn good. This is uh, Ian Gasta. When I met her. Uh, this is Major Roddenberry. Okay. Talked to her on the phone. I didn't meet her in person. OK. 
Okay. One of my favorite reporters, Mike McCardle, CTV News. Make sure you watch Last Word Tonight with Mike McCardle. I met Mike first a long time ago, a real long time ago. We did a lot of stories together. He is a genius in story making. I'm the owners of the fire marshal and the mayor of New Westminster. I donated and gave away all this gear to this company, Paul Pincott, Can-Am Imports, Bridge Studios. You can see all the stuff. He put it in this display here. Wow. Denver, Colorado, 1994. Stanley Steamer, Tim Carey. Filming dumber and dumber as we're getting smarter and smarter inside the building. That's me up on the top with the end. And Dr. Makowski and Dr. Pudoff and Brock, Dr. Brian O'Leary Tuari and many others. So, using iPad clips, I put together some photos that can, primitive photos that can go into a video, and this is, I'm ending with this one of me looking on today. A lot different than that idiot you saw, I don't know how many years ago. But anyway, I'm having fun, are you?